Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to another video, another episode of our Ugarte to Glory series because this is going crazy. Our series has actually taken a direction towards the right way and I am so happy you guys are enjoying it. Now episode number, I think this is episode number 5. If my brain cells are in the right place, I think I am recording episode number 5. Let me just have a real chick. Yeah, it is episode number 5. Hope you guys enjoyed the previous 4 episodes. Now in today's episode, what we are going to be doing is, I don't know what is the title and thumbnail of this video yet. I just opened and I have done some background work. Uh, in today's episode, we are going to be playing Rivals at the end. Hopefully, we will complete our uh, Ugarte's evolution in today's episode because I just need to win one game and achieve a clean sheet with him. Uh, if we do that, it is successfully completed and then we'll uh, look at some other evolutions to complete uh, but the main thing in today's today's video is going to moments and opening some packs there we are going to do that after we open the store packs i have some child packs some baby packs some kids packs some some decent packs as well in store so we're going to open all those and then we're going we're gonna to head straight to moments and then i have 150 points if i'm absolutely bang on the nose i have 150 points we can open i'll show you guys i'll show you guys but hope you guys are doing well hope you guys are enjoying the content on the channel make sure you guys check out the channel we have uh, rtg series in fc mobile going on we have rtg series on this very own game going on which you guys are watching right now we have player career mode going on and hopefully you guys are you know enjoying it and i am feeling great about these series that is being run on this channel but i don't like the pack openings today because the pack opening has been absolutely horrifying what are these why do i need a loot and badge okay you know what i'm, I'm not gonna be hasty i'm not gonna be hasty mm, i'll i'll take a loot and badge we have an 82 plus pack we have a 75 times 2 75 times 2 we have a bunch of 75 times too and then guys the moments is where is so important i i can't okay we get a walkout no it's not a walkout it's just a out it's not a walkout we already have him i don't need the same player 101 times but i'll take a duplicate frankowski oh you know what frankowski might go into the team not even gonna lie moreno with 87 pace at left mid you know what this might be low rated players but they are looking like potential starters for the team. I am not even joking. 82 plus. Will we get a walkout? It is going to be a walk. But it is going to be a... Uh, it's not a walkout. It's always just a walk. I don't need a walk. Give me a walkout. Somebody do you give me the triangle at the back. Ben Munich. I don't see the position. Woo! We get Serge Navri. I am going to be using him. If I can play him at right wing or right... No, I can't play him at right wing because we have an absolute monster at right wing at the moment. We can play him at left mid. You know, I don't know if he'll play. His shooting is basic. His, his pace is very, very below average. I need pace, guys. If you have not seen me play, we need pace in the team. If without pace, we are absolutely nothing. Because everybody in this game has insane pacey players. It's not a walkout again. Somebody is always walking, but it's Abameyang. Ubameyang. Abumeyang. How do you call it? Abama what? Abama who? Abama blood clot yang. Absolutely monstrous player, but I'm actually surprised he left Marseille, you know. He might be playing for me at striker, but will he be able to replace Kolo Muani? Because Darwin Nunez is not going anywhere. He's a monster at striker for me, Darwin Nunez. Is he going to replace Kolo Muani? That's the big question right now. It's another walk, not an out. CDM, French. How many RSL players are we lock, uh, getting? Lapsley will take a Kante. But how is Kante not a walk out but just a walk? Is he an 85 rated player? I'll take it. I don't know if he'll start though. I don't know if he'll start ahead of uh, Kalan Oglo. He's definitely not going to start instead of Ugarte. But yeah, I'll take a player. We can use him at SPC. In the future episode, we might end up doing SPCs. So I'll take him. Another walk. Not an out. It's a female player. Right back. I have no clue what country that is. It's from French League? Okay. Please be pacey. 81 is not pacey. It's just pace. I don't really care about 81. Alibis. We are getting good names. 
but those names have been absolutely done dirty i'm not gonna lie yeah i've done them dirty alaves at 62 pace so what is that walk it's not an out again it's not an out cdm germany Liga, I need Liga players guys, I need to complete that uh, squad foundation or whatever it's called, imagine if it's a duplicate. Okay, I don't think it's a duplicate. But she has good pace and shooting for a CDM, she has good dribbling, defending. You know what, decent stats, I'll take it. I'll take it. Imagine if we get something from our uh, preview packs. Is, pre is doing a preview pack necessary? It is unnecessary. But now is the moment that I have been waiting for, that you guys have been waiting for, that pretty much everybody in this world has been waiting for. It's the moments. Ah, I don't have 150. I have only 144. You know what? We're going to make sure we are going to open for 150 moments points. Because first off, we'll open this. We'll open one of this and then we'll open two of these. And then we'll go do some grinding for moments and then come back and open one more of this. Because in today's episode, even if you don't do rivals, I don't care. We are gonna we are gonna open these packs. I don't know who clicked that button. I don't yeah. We're gonna open this. How do I open this? Select 15, 81 times 2. We're gonna get a walkout. 100 percent we're gonna get a walkout. It's a walk. Oh, let's go. We get a walkout. Our second walkout at a centimeter from Oh my god, we got what is his name? Gundogan? <laughs> Let us go, we got Gundogan. <laughs> Finally a decent player. Finally a decent player. I can take shots from outside the box. Finally. I know he has awful pace. I'm going to make sure he gets pace. And I'm going to use him in my squad. So we get a good player. 87 rated player. Our highest rated so far. 80. I wish it was the, I wish it was the Hernandez who had more pace. You know what? Out of 81 times double, I'll absolutely take that. But you know, you know what is the sad part though, guys? We've got insane player out of that. Out of this rare player pack, if we don't get a promo or a walkout, I'll be sad because I sat and grinded this out for so so many hours. We don't get a promo. We don't get a walkout. This is sad. Sentiment. Spain. Who is this? Fabian? No, it's not. I don't even know who I was thinking of. Is there a player called Fabian in the first place? Alex C. Garcia. Is that how you pronounce his name? First name? Alexi? Alex? Ale Alex. We get Rafael Varan. I'll take enough. I'll absolutely take him and pair him up. Oh, this is a tradable pack. Nice. You know what? We don't get Ronaldo, but we get Real Nildo. I'll take Real Nildo instead of Ronaldo. We get Varan, guys. I'm happy with Varan. Somerville will get 91 pace. We get Pepe again. This summer will playing at right okay can play at right wing. Is I need good center backs. We get on we get Varan who can play at center back. We need some pacey midfielders now. I think midfielders pacey midfielders is what my brain cells are thinking about right now. We get some pacey midfielders that is more than enough for me. I'm gonna just send them on top. Okay, we can we can open one more of this and then we'll have nine points left. We need more six I think according to my mathematics. So after this, we're gonna sit and grind out moments. In today's episode, we're gonna grind moments, guys. That is the highlight. A walkout? Absolutely no. The game is like, if I get the same guy again. You know what? I think opening the 81 times two is the best grind you guys can do. Don't open this rare player pack. You are gonna get absolutely nobody because I got absolutely nobody. We got Guardiol. I'll take Guardiol play my center back. You know what? This was a stinky one. This was a stinky one. We need to go get one more pack at least. We need to go get this uh, 81 times 2. I wish I knew this but beforehand. I would have just opened this one 81 times 2. At least like I can open 5 of these. I think in a day. Oh, I think for 30 days you can open 5 of these. So make sure you guys sit and grind moments out. And open five of these instead of this rare player packs and i think you are better off with opening these uh, 15 moment thingies and this 25 moment thingies instead of the 60 moment thingy because that is absolutely of no point and i have learned that the hard way now what am i going to do i'm i need how many more i need six more so what well, the best thing for me to do is either win this which is very hard for some reason i need to score a finish shot from left side of the pitch completely Three or less passes, maximum one shot attempt. Okay, this is not gonna happen. Score a goal with centimeter, assist a goal with centimeter. 
complete a tackle with sentiment maybe i can do this this is going to take the whole episode guys because i am not good with this assist a goal with left wing get a goal with right wing i think we are going to attempt this first we need 6 if we complete 3 of this it is going to be more than enough you know what we're going to do a different squad i am not going to chase it and make changes here we're going to use my fringe fc squad we're just going to do one change here not going to bring her out obviously we're just going to bring her here her here put in agarte agarte i think we need to put in ugarte instead of agarte take out othamendi bring in guardiol actually i would love to bring in varan but uh, due to the mishaps in chemistry yeah we have one we have two we have three players from wsl so i am happy with this we need to assist a goal score a goal and get a tackle with the center midfielder so we have three we have we have kalanoglu we can do this i think first is getting a tackle okay i don't think getting a tackle is the first thing possible i have 14 minutes i can easily take my time and do this okay complete a tackle is done i need to assist the goal damn it kalanoglu ah uh, imagine i assist to dugarte and score with kalanoglu absolutely brilliant it will be Ah, we have failed in the first attempt. Oh my God! It's gonna take at least a million attempts, guys. It's gonna take a million attempts. Please embrace yourselves. Kalanoglu, we get a goal and an assist, which is absolutely the easiest thing to do. Now we need to just complete our tackle. Ugarte, my guy. How? Yeah. We have completed the first task with Ugarte and both our other midfielders guys let us go 2 points in we need four more Imagine by mistake i only clicked the first part and i didn't select for both i would have lost my brain cells Okay now team chemistry complete five through ball passes in opponent side complete five passes in opponent's box I have 10 minutes to do this. It's not pretty, it's not hard, but I have to play against a semi-pro team if I have to take this two times. Anyway, if I have to do first one separately and second one separately, it's gonna be the same. I feel like completing it together is the best thing. Score a goal with right wing, get an assist. I have only three minutes for this. That's not fair. Win the match. You know what? I think win the match. What we'll do now? It's 25 minutes is there. We can actually win the match. We can score a bunch of goals. I feel like we'll be some one nil or two nil down. We can score a bunch of goals with the pace that we have up front. We can defend with the defenders we have uh, at the bot at, at at the end. And Real Madrid have conceded a goal in IRL. And Manchester United are having a stinker in the league and in the cup and everywhere. And I am supporting these two teams, thinking that I will be happy. But Real Madrid are giving me a roller coaster ride, and Manchester are giving me a dungeon ride. I don't like this. First goal in. Let us go. Yes. <laughs> Man, am I recording? Imagine I do all this and I'm not recording. Oh my God! It's an absolute Darwin Nunez situation where he misses the first chance and he scores the second chance. I think I'm I'm have kept a Manchester United, but I think that's why this roller coaster of emotion is happening here. But actually, I'm playing better than what I played offline. It absolutely took took me ages to complete this, and I just gave up. And now I'm completing this, and I'm winning. And Darwin Nunez has scored two goals. You know what? I'm not going to show you any more clips of this game, particular game. We'll just I'll just uh, finish this. Okay, we have completed this. We need two more, guys. We need two more. What is the absolutely easiest thing to do in this game, in this moments thingy? You know what? We're gonna do once again. What we have? We can open one more now. After this, ah, uh, we'll end the episode. We'll go do the squad updating thingy, and we'll call it a day for today. 
because I, certain certain episodes are gonna be relaxed and chill and small guys because usually i sit and do big episodes like 15 16 minute episodes and sometimes i think even i need to give respect to you guys this time and i need to keep it short i have 10 minutes to do all these things okay you know what we'll do this thing and then we'll go open that absolutely wonderful pack First attempt itself is an absolute failure because of a stupid offside decision. Of a stupid offside decision, first first attempt has gone to the bin. Oh my god! I completed the first one. Second one we need to have complete only two more, and then absolutely stunk up the gaff. Oh. I just started and I already lost position. This is what? Try number four? Failure? How was this easy? But it's hard. I am gonna cry, guys. I am not even joking. I am gonna cry. Four passes completed inside with the team which is always pressing. Pressing, pressing, and then last second. I think I should just score a goal. One eternity later. This is easy. I just need to pass it here. And you know what the tougher part is? This challenges box keeps popping up in front. <laughs> I have completed it successfully. <laughs> oh my god, after so many tries, I have completed it. We have got 15 points. And now we are going to go and open that 81 times 2 from which we got our first ever walkout on the series. No, it's actually we got Kalanoglu. We packed Kalanoglu. But the title of today's video is going to be I packed my first ever walkout. Sure, it's kind of true. It's kind of not true. But it is the game. Come here, 81 times 2. Absolutely insane pack this was. Absolutely insane. Promo, promo. Walk out. It's not a walk out. It's not a promo, but we got a striker from Nigeria. Syria. Is it? Is it him? It can't be him. Who is he? Lukman. Lukman is actually a pretty decent player, guys. Lukman is doing bits for Atlanta. Not even joking. I'm pretty sure he's from Atlanta. Why is what is this? Cals? Bergamo Calcio? I don't think that team exists. I'm pretty sure he plays for Atlanta, right? Am I wrong? Is Atlanta even a Syria club at this point? You know what? Let's go update the team. Let's go update the team. You know what? Henry has been a really good really good option for me. Like whenever I feel like I need a player who can just get the job done, Henry has been him. Henry has been him for me at left back position and to replace him we bring in Balde. Balde is also an absolute monster. Now Ake doesn't play here anymore guys. I am afraid I have to put Ake out. I might still go with Kaur you know. Not gonna lie he's the best defender I have at the moment. Is he, is he better than Guardiola? Probably. Is he better than Varan? Varan is a legend. Hmm, you know what? I'm so confused. Do I just look about the worry about the pace? I don't know, you know, I don't know. I want to play Varan so badly. I can't increase Varan's pace, so I'm 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 actually play Varan. He's good at the you know, he's 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 good in the air as well, Varan. I can increase his pace a little bit. What is pace goes up to? Plus two, plus two. Ah, you know what, I'll take it. What other positions can we improve? Can we improve? Can, can, I feel like Gusto is the best right back I have in my team at the moment. I don't think anybody is better than Gusto at the moment. So I'm just going to play him. Frankowski is a better choice. He has 72 shooting, 75 passing, a little less dribbling and defending compared to Gusto. What he loses Kem a lot. You know what? I'll do this. I'm going to take out 
David, who scored against Real Madrid, so I don't like him anymore. I'm just joking, and David is a really good player. So I'm gonna bring in Frankowski. Uh, what position is in? Yeah, I'm gonna bring in Frankowski, keep him in my subs, and just use him as my substitute. I can do five subs, I'm pretty sure of that. So I'm just gonna do that, and bring, because of Varan, even Gonzalez gets a thingy over there. Um, that sounds bad. But you know what? It's actually looking decent. The team is looking decent. I might have to change the formation a little bit in order to accommodate. Do I just go with a single striker up front? I can do that. I can play only Nunez and play this. And instead of... Uh, yeah, I think I can do that. I think this team looks good. I don't know how it's going to be. We're going to try it out in the next episode. Make sure you guys subscribe and follow and like all that good stuff to check it out because in today's episode I feel like we've done a lot and we have updated the team pretty decently. We brought in one, two, three, four new players in and we have a pretty decent bench as well from the looks of it. I know many of you guys won't agree with me keeping Casemiro or Galeno in the team but Galeno is really good and Casemiro is the love of my life so I'm just going to keep them. And for a center back choice, I'm gonna take out Otamendi and bring in Core. Yeah. Just look at the difference here. Core is a 75 rated player. Imagine if he was an 85 rated player. Otamendi is absolutely nothing in front of him at the moment. So, you know what? That's a good episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We still have some pretty decent players here, guys. Um, I'm feeling bad that I'm leaving these guys just in the club here. But we will be using them soon as well. Now. I think we will be opening few more packs in the next episode? Question mark? Maybe. We are going to open our Rivals Rewards in the next episode. That is there for sure. Uh, our Rivals Rewards are not that great, guys. I'm, I'll be honest. The, the amount of grind we are putting in for Rivals, it's absolutely a stinker of a reward and even same with squad battles. Unless you go for Elite 1, Elite 2, you are not getting anything good. But how do you grind for that much when you can only play 12 games? Doesn't make sense. But okay, it is what it is. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed, guys. Until next time, take care, stay safe, stay motivated, and keep smiling. Bye-bye.